it's Yukemi Olabisi, the farm lady, and you are welcome to another amazing, interesting, and educative video. Today, we are feeding our fishes. So if you like to see how we feed the fishes at the hatchery, then you should keep watching this video. So guys you welcome back to my youtube channel and like i said in the beginning of this video i want to show you guys how we feed the fishes at the hatchery in here i have some amazing amazing feed ingredients and you don't want to know what is in here but i'm going to be giving you guys a few of the ingredients i have in here in here i have the house fly maggot i have the black soldier fly lava grinded already in this i have fish feed that is the one that was purchased outside from the feed vendors in here so mixing all that together it's really 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 nutritious high in protein fiber carbohydrates whatsoever you can think of that will make your fishes grow so i'm about to feed them i'm here beside one of the rats containing our fingerlings and then about to feed them so here we go you have a technique when you're, when you're feeding you don't just you know spread it all over the surface of the water you feed lightly to see if they are going to respond very well to the feeding so i'm just going to test the waters so we are testing the waters to see their reaction okay it seems they are hungry so now we can increase the quantity so we feed them lightly as you can see them they are all coming to the surface of the water to eat so I feed them like so I feed them like so I feed them like so And then also you have to ensure that you don't overfeed them you feed them what they can take per time and that is what i'm doing some people might pour this whole container into the water no that is wrong you feed them what they can eat per time because looking at them they are still very small they are babies these are catfish fingerlings so you feed them what they can eat per time not too much and then they are okay and also to avoid water pollution you don't overfeed overfeeding is a very very wrong practice when it comes to feeding your catfish fingerlings at the hatchery so you feed them the required quantity per time per time and per reaction how they react it doesn't mean oh um they're supposed to eat this quantity of feed and then when they are not even reacting or they are not active then you still give them the, that quantity it's really wrong so you have to test the water first like i said see their reaction to the feed and if they are reacting very well then you can now feed them properly so that is what i did here basically so i hope you guys enjoyed that feeding and they are still feeding now so I don't know if you have any question on this you can drop your question in the description or in the comment section below drop your questions anything that you want to ask as regards feeding catfish fingerlings so thank you guys so much for staying with me on this video it was amazing you know coming to the hatchery to feed them and I hope you guys enjoyed the video as well. So if you enjoyed this video, please give this video a big thumbs up. And also drop a comment below. Subscribe if you're not yet subscribed to this channel. Turn on your post notification. And it's bye for now. Thank you guys. Mm -hmm.